Ms. Mariah Espada. Ms. Uh, Santos Moreno. My name is Pablo Moreno. My name is Chelsea Fosu. My name is Jared Jeffcoat. My name is Yasmin Ben Hamid. My name is Ralph Costas. Both my parents are from Texas, but I'm originally from New Mexico. My family is originally from Tunisia, but I was first generation born here in the States. Oh, I was originally born in New Jersey. My mother was born in uh, Havana, Cuba, and my father was born in the Bronx, but he is uh, Puerto Rican and Mexican. Me and my family reside in Brooklyn, New York, but we are originally from Puerto Rico. We are from Chicago, Illinois, but my parents hail from Mexico before they came to the United States. So I personally was born here in America, but both of my parents are from Ghana. College was always instilled in me from a young age. There was no other option. To do something that our family members have sacrificed so much for, it just, I guess it's an honor. Growing up in the poorest congressional district in America, I felt like there was no there'd be no reason why I would not come to college. I'm so beyond grateful that I was the person that was able to make it to this point, but sometimes it's a bit lonely not being able to relate to anyone else in my family. Being the first one to go to college, I was also the first one to be away from home. No one could really give me advice on what to expect. I feel like it's really easy for everyone to say they've been like totally encouraged, but there have been times that I've felt discouraged. I didn't think I would feel as much an outsider as I did when I got to college. It's kind of a struggle when the only people you could really identify with are the ones that clean up after you and serve you your food. So. Now that I've completed my first year of college, quite honestly, I think it was really difficult. I haven't had many uh, family members that have made it even through high school, let alone college. I did not really expect um, for it to be so difficult to explain to like people who aren't here. We're really making progress for the colored people on campus, but I really did expect to see a lot more numerically than I do see. Feeling like maybe I'm not cut out enough for it. I think that pressure is a huge part of the first generation college student experience. Yeah, there is a lot of pressure sometimes because I don't want to fail because I want to be the first one that made it and that way everyone else in my family who's younger than me can see that they can make it too. Proud. So although there is a lot of pressure at times, I do know that in the end, it's going to be worth it. To be like at graduation holding a paper and a certificate that says I made it, it's not just for me, it's for my little brother. It's for my parents who are making one of the biggest sacrifices financially, emotionally, mentally for me. I think I was really encouraged by my mom in a way, um, telling me that she, you know, how proud she was of me and telling me that I could definitely do these things. Uh, I get a start. Uh, that a lot of my family members didn't get. It's a significant scale for minority communities altogether to start going to college in order to try and close the educational achievement gap that we are currently facing. Just because of your experience might be different doesn't necessarily mean that it doesn't have any substance to it because our experiences also tell a, a story of people overcoming adversity to get to where they need to go. Now that I'm here, I feel more empowered than I've ever felt. I feel as though I can honestly take over the world. The thing we've sacrificed, everything we've left back home, is it won't be for nothing. I will be successful and that I will make something of myself. I can do anything I want to as long as I set my mind to it. If I had to give advice to future first-gen students, I would say do it. Once you step on that campus, find a support network and find people who have kind of gone through the same things you have. Go for it 100%. It's totally worth it. Just the feeling you get when you know you've accomplished something and when you're, you're on your way to where everyone has worked so hard to get you, it's the best feeling in the world. And along the way, you will, you will surprise yourself because I've surprised myself. I'm first generation college student and I'm unstoppable. And I'm motivated. I'm different. Yeah, I'm different. I'm inspirational. I'm strong and I am the future.